pronounced, defined, used in lexical dispatch. Censure, non-adverb, harsh criticism or disapproval, an official reprimand, to criticize severely, condemnation, animadversion, reproof, reproach, obelisk, noun, a tall stone column with four sloping sides and a pointed top made in honor of an important person or event. In printing, a dagger symbol. One investigation into a midwife's conduct led to no cause for censure. Many of them were perceived as dissidents and suffered various degrees of censure. The Supreme Court may censure, suspend, or remove a judge or justice for violating a rule of judicial conduct and may retire a judge or justice for disability which is permanent or is likely to become permanent and which seriously interferes with the performance of judicial duties. Prior to the committee's censure, she offered her resignation. One of the described matters involves the public censure of an attorney for criticism of a judicial officer. It is now quite evident I had come to the wrong conclusion concerning your apparent censure of one of my comments. The solution is not censure and excommunication, which was the fate of too many theologians in the past. They even voted to censure him, and he was the first president to receive such a rebuke. When a councilman crosses the line while serving, he may in fact be censured by the sitting council. Have you ever been censured, suspended, or reprimanded for your business practices? While I've avoided censuring individual scientists and others over this whole episode until the context is better understood, you have now provided such a context. Why do we censure the present system without telling people how things should be? The obelisk was originally created by the Egyptian mysteries of the pharaohs and is spoken of in the Bible. The second granite obelisk that once stood here now graces the Place de la Concorde in Paris. The earliest timekeeper, dating from as far back as 3500 BC, was the shadow clock, or gnomon, a vertical obelisk that cast a shadow. This prophecy was dealing with a political leader who would deliberately face a major obelisk at a critical time in world history. Reagan addressed the crowd to give his inaugural speech. He was facing the great obelisk, the Washington Monument. The obelisk is the oldest man-made object in Central Park, also known as the Cleopatra's Needle. The monument standing 71 feet tall and weighing 244 tons took 112 days to transfer from Egypt to New York City.